It's true, I was having a hard time sleeping the last few months, but I have been taking Dream by Beam and sleeping all night and waking up feeling refreshed. Now my favorite are the Dream CBD supplements, but maybe you would prefer something like the Dream Powder. That's right, Dream Powder comes in different flavors and potencies so you can get exactly what's right for you. So sleep well this summer. Check the link in this video description and use my coupon code FARMGIRL at checkout for 35% off your first order. If you fall in love and you start sleeping fabulous and you want a subscription, they're gonna give you 20% off your subscription each month. Check the link in this video description for 35% off and sleep better with Dream. Hello lovelies, I'm Angela. This is Parisian Farm Girl. Bienvenue, welcome to the channel. If two things can be true at the same time, then it can be true that I love my kitchen. You know how I feel about my range and my copper collections and my dishes. And the other thing that's true is that this kitchen is a hot mess. We ripped out those cabinets and we made all those changes about five and a half years ago when we first moved in, doing what I call neutralizing the ugly. So we got rid of the whole 1984 vibe and we tried to make it our own. So here we are, all this time later. I still want that unfitted kitchen. I'm very, very, very grateful to have the range and some of the beautiful things that I have in this space. However, it's not done. I'm still saving for the floor. I still have really funky birch logs holding up my really cool copper sink. And most of the time, for me, it just feels like a hot mess. So I love it, and at the same time, I'm really, really frustrated with it. So it's a cool day here this mid-July, and I've been gathering a few things here and there at flea markets and some of my favorite local resale shops. And I'm just going to make some changes in this room because sometimes you just need a fix. You just need something new. And speaking of two things being true at the same time, you can have a room in your home that looks really great one way, and it's really, really easy to think this is the only way this room can be as far as paint color and furniture arrangement. But I want to encourage you to go ahead and experiment. Move some things around, try it. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't always have to be the ideal arrangement of that room, so I think what I'm gonna do today is move my center island sort of back when it was right here. Um, I used to film more cooking videos on YouTube when we had it this way. And I have some new bar stools from a local thrift shop. I'm gonna see how they work. I'm just gonna play a little bit and bring you along. And I just wanted to encourage you in your own spaces to try some things. Move the furniture around. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be totally ideal experiment move it back in a few months have some fun take out the seriousness of making your home the way you want it to be of expressing creativity in your own space don't be intimidated by everything you see online where everything looks absolutely picture perfect goodness knows if you could see these navy blue cabinets that i painted a few months ago Nothing is picture perfect around here, but that doesn't matter. It's ours. We're gonna have some fun today, and I'm inviting you along. Speaking of things not being perfect, this is what I'm talking about. See these drawers? They are really, really bad, and we just slapped some paint on them. Probably, was it last winter? Uh, because they needed it. They, they needed a change, but everything like right where the camera is, is temporary. What we really want is a big workbench. We wanna put um, marble on top of it and have it on casters so that we can move it around the kitchen, sort of like we're gonna do with this one today. This is just a funky old workbench from some old man's garage. I love it, it's worked really well for us. I have the marble on top of that. So we definitely have some ideas for this space, but like I said, they're just going to take a really long time. If you like interior design and you wanna learn more about creating beautiful spaces in your own home, join my Old World Design Society. You know you hear me talk about it all the time. There's gonna be some sort of icon on top of the screen. You can do it for $5 a month. Every month I do a live design Q&A call. Send me your pictures of what's going on in your house and I'm going to give you my very best ideas on what to do with that space. And then of course, 
If you want to, you can upgrade to the magazine. But now I'm gonna move the camera. I'm filming myself today, so we're gonna do our best. And I'm gonna try to move this island over here. And we're gonna see if we can just sort of change things up again. I have a tiny new little Persian scatter rug. We're just gonna make some improvements and sort of refresh this space for summer. Before I do that, why don't I show you a little bit around the space so you can get a feeling of what it looks like before. This is so heavy and I feel really bad for the legs because they move and they're already split which is why we have the tape around them. I don't know if I'm gonna like this design or not but I'm just gonna do with it. I'm gonna go through with it and sit on it for a few weeks and see what I think. The idea is that I'm gonna move the island coming off here like it used to but the Laconche is deeper than the old junky range that we had here. So I'm thinking this is probably going to be pretty tight. So I don't know, maybe I'll sacrifice a few drawers and put it back. I just need something different right now. So we'll see. Okay, let's get into it here. Here's what I'm thinking. Luga, we call her Luga, after Lugrezia, the maid from the Durls in Corfu. Uh, Luga, I want her to be front and center. I have this thing about when you walk in a room and there's a statement piece, whether it's a fabulous piece of art or a beautifully made bed, or in this case, my gorgeous range that I waited so long for, I want her to be front and center and before she was being blocked by the island. So I have these cute bar stools that I got at my friend's resale shop. Oh boy, I don't know if this is gonna work. <laughs> I have these these uh, bar stools that I got at my friend's resale shop. And I'd like the kids to have a place to sort of sit and visit with me this summer while I'm cooking. I'm gonna go ahead and sacrifice these three drawers. I hate those blue cabinets. They are old and junky. So I'm gonna move this island and let's make it happen.
it's going to work, at least for now, while I'm waiting for my dream floors and to find that statement piece to replace those old blue cabinets. In the meantime, visit ParisianFarmGirl.com. You can do that by clicking this little logo right here. You'll learn all about the trips to Paris there. You can read the blog posts. You can find out about the Old World Design Society magazine. Watch another video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you very soon. A bientôt.